We, the entertainment-loving people, want an unlimited data plan that gives us more. We want more than just texting. More than just surfing and shopping. Because sure, we want to use this to call the people we love, like our directors. But mostly, to get the entertainment we love. Switch to AT&T for the only unlimited plan that gives you 60 channels of live television on any screen, all for $70 a month. Hey Wolfpack fans, I'm Leah Bruce and this is The Daily brought to you by AT&T. This week the Wolfpack had many wins between the men and women's basketball team, the football team, the women's soccer team, and the volleyball team. NC State picked up their second win of Kevin Keats' season after the Wolfpack defeated Charleston Southern 78-59 Sunday afternoon. Alaric Freeman led all scorers with 18 points, Markel Johnson finished with 12 points in a game high of 9 assists, while Leonard Freeman led the players with 8 rebounds. The Buccaneers held the lead early in the first half, but that was the only time they were on top during the game against the Pack. NC State exploded for a 17-0 run to end the period, including three straight three-pointers from Sam Hunt. Elric Freeman started strong as he scored 10 of the pack's 15 points as he went 4-for-4 four four from the field over the first eight minutes of the game. Torin Dorn added nine points in the second half to help put the Bucks away. NC State is back in action tomorrow evening at 7 p.m. against the Bryant Bulldogs inside PNC Arena. Also starting off their season 2-0, the women's basketball team defeated the Davidson Wildcats 73-49 last night inside Reynolds. Lucky Rood led the pack with a career high of 21 points. Chelsea Nelson left the game with 15 points, Akila Mays with 10, and Kai Crutchfield with 11. The Wolfpack jumped out on the Wildcats early with a 10-0 lead in the first three minutes of play and led from there. The pack will be back Wednesday evening against UNC Asheville at 7 p.m. in Reynolds Coliseum. The football team bagged another win against Boston College this weekend and now has five ACC wins this season, the most for the pack since 2010. Jalen Samuels rushed in from eight yards out late in the second quarter and Kyle Bambard connected on a 41-yard field goal at the end of the half. NC State took the lead with eight minutes to go when Naeem Hines scored from 50 yards out to bump the pack up 17 to 14. Boston College lined up to attempt a 39-yard field goal with just over four minutes left, but a bad snap led to an incomplete pass and Pack took over at its own 22nd yard line. With 2.5 sacks in the game, Bradley Chubb has become NC State's all-time leader in career sacks to surpass Mario Williams' previous mark of 25.5. Chubb now has 26 sacks for his career. Also, with four tackles for loss this weekend, Chubb ties the school record of 55.5 with Mario Williams. The Pack will be back on the road again this weekend as they head to Wake Forest. NC State women's soccer team won the first round of NCAA Saturday afternoon against Arkansas 4-1. Zaria King quickly put up the team with a goal on the sixth minute on a double assist by Maxine Blackwood and Rachel Cox. King doubled her team's score in the 50th minute thanks to another double assist by Hannah Keogh and Maxine Blackwood. Paige Griffiths recorded her third goal of the season in the 63rd minute that finished in the right corner of the net. Kia Rankin scored the pack's fourth goal in the 78th minute with a strike that hit the left post and went into the net. Keogh worked her way into NC State's record book as her 10 assists this year ranked six for the most in a single season. The pack will now face Princeton University in the second round November 17th at 2.30 p.m. at Wake Med Park in Cary, North Carolina. The volleyball team has broken the program record in a 3-0 sweep against Georgia Tech Saturday evening in Reynolds Coliseum. For the second consecutive season, the Wolfpack sets the record for ACC wins as the team owns 14 wins in league play. NC State also completes a perfect home ACC season as the Pack's 10 home conference wins is the most in program history without a loss in the first undefeated home season since 1988. NC State will return Friday evening when they travel to Louisville at 7 p.m. And that's it for The Daily. Make sure to like us on Facebook, follow us on Twitter, and check out all our social media at go.ncsu.edu sports. I'm Leah Bruce from Pack TV, bringing you into the pack.